Hello everybody, this is Star Wars 1904, also known as Kelsey, and I am doing here a very quick um, video, well, actually might not be that quick, um, because the 1.8 update for PC Minecraft is out, Woo, and then you get a quick glimpse of what's to come. Okay, so first of all we have this, um, a new new doors, well, not really, they're doors, but basically if you craft it with a certain type of wood, um, it will make the door out of that certain type of wood. So before, if you made it with um, spruce wood, for example, which is one here, um, it would still come out as an oak door. But now it doesn't. So this here is the spruce door, which I think looks a bit like a barnyard sort of thing. So quite good for it. This one's the birch one, which, hmm, not too bad. Um, I don't know. I think, hmm, it kind of looks like white chocolate a little bit, but sort of sandstone as well. But I kind of like it. Um, this next one here is the jungle one, I believe. Yep, yeah, jungle. So I just had to look there. It's jungle. I quite like this because it's sort of like a window in it. And um, this next one I particularly like. Particularly like. Sorry, guys. This is the acacia one. I think that's how you pronounce it. I apologise if I'm pronouncing anything in this wrong. As there's a few new. new yeah. Sorry, guys. There's a few new blocks and they're quite difficult to pronounce. So this is the acacia. Door, which I think is quite good for like jails, but obviously you can still open it, which wouldn't be that great. Um, this is the dark oak wood, which I think looks really cool if you're doing like a house sort of thing. So like doors and rooms. So I think that will be rather good. Here guys, this is a new one. We have the iron trap door, where as you can see, you can't open it. You'd have to use a lever resin, which I believe is new. Um, yes, it is new actually. So that's really good, I think, for if you're trying to store something, like if you're making a shop or something. That will be quite cool. Now here, this is what I really like. This is sponge. Okay, and here, you can see here, you can get wet sponge now as well. So if I just take this sponge, and I place it in this water here, you can see it absorbs it. Which will be kind of cool if you are looking to do that sort of thing. Um, maybe if water spawns where you don't want it to, you could do it. Although, if you do it in the ocean, um, it's quite complicated actually. As I, I found the tea temple, which I'm going to talk about in a bit. Um, and it obviously it doesn't take the whole thing away, but it's quite confusing with the streams of the water. So, anyway, so here's some of the new blocks that I was talking about. First of all, this is granite, which I think looks rather nice actually. Um, could use it maybe for barns and um, anything really. Buildings would look particularly good. However, I do like this next block here. Good transition, trans, yeah, transition there. Not transition. You know what I'm on about, guys. Um, this is polished granite, so basically this, but it's actually polished. I think it's quite cool. Um, not that they have polish in Minecraft, but you never know. So that I really like. Um, this next one here is, right now, I'm sorry if I pronounced one, this one wrong. I think it's Dormite, or Dormit, something like that. Dormit, I'm going to say Dormit. Okay, and here again you have it polished. And um, you can't really tell the difference between it very, very much. Obviously you can a little bit, but... Not too much, I would like to say. Now this one, again, so if I'm not just wrong. And andesite, andesit. We're gonna say andesite, andesite, and andesit. I'm saying andesit. Um, which is that block there? Kind of looks bluey grey to me, hint of green. I quite like that one. Also here again, polished. Now this one here, uh, this is red sand. Now you have actually been able to get this. Sorry, yes, that was a sign there in um certain servers on the pc um i won't mention them for certain reasons which i quite like you can get sand so i'm going to show you a little bit later on uh, now this block here guys this i really really like this is called uh what's this got the slime block that's it and if you jump on it i'm going to jump on this one you see you bounce up and i'm not pressing the jump pad at all there guys same happens with this one i believe you bounce um a high 60% uh, of what you drop. So if I drop from here, we'll see how I'm going to bounce quite high if I actually hit the bounce bar. Woo! That's really high. And you actually bounce 60% of whatever drop you did, which I think is quite good. I believe that's true. I'm not entirely sure, guys. I'll find out for you. Um, and this one, um, what is this one called? Sorry, guys. I feel like that's probably in your face. This is called Pris Prismarine? Prism Prismarine. I'm going to say Prismarine. Yes, I'm sorry I can't pronounce them. I'll write what they are called. Um, I might make them pop up as an annotation every time I'm near them. Or I might write them in, in the description. Not sorry yet, guys. Okay, so I do like, I do want to apologise on that. They are spelled pretty much how they sound, I would presume. So that's why I'm saying Prismarine. 
Not sure, guys. Uh, now, all these blocks here, these four blocks, one, two, three, four, in case you know what four is, they are found in sea temples, which I was talking about earlier. Now, I did find one on another server, but obviously not on this one. So, yeah, I'm trying to fly. Okay, it's glitching out a little bit, so I can't fly. Um, so, yeah. These are found in sea temples, which are kind of cool, and they're protected by these fairly vicious, let's say, um, creatures. I tried to take one on with just a diamond, with just a iron sword and some chainmail armor. It killed me very quickly, as it did with my friend. Um, this one is the Prismarine Bricks. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I think that would look kind of good if you're doing a church. I know not many people do a church in Minecraft. But if you do, I think that would look quite nice. Obviously, you might want to go for some of the traditional ones, but I think that looks rather nice. I quite like that block. Um, the next one is Dark Prismarine. Uh, so basically, it's essentially that first block there, just darker. Um, again, I, I do kind of like that one. I think that maybe look quite good, maybe in a bedroom sort of thing. Anything really, guys. You can basically use any of these blocks for anything. I'm just making suggestions off the top of my head here. Okay, this one's sea lanterns. Is that right? Yes, yeah, sea lanterns. These are found within the sea temples, and I really like them. I'm not sure if they give off light. I'm presuming with them being lanterns. The view of the city sea is quite bright. Um, oh no, no, it's like you can actually see up there. That is really cool. I quite like that. Okay, the next one. This is red sandstone, which I was on about. So this is the normal red sandstone. Here it is chiseled. This one it is as uh, what's this one? What are you? Smooth sandstone, that's right. Um, this is the steps, and these are the half slabs. I kind of like that. Now, as with the doors, these are the fences and fence gates. You can see he got spruce, birch, jungle. Dark oak and acacia, same again with these. Okay, these guys I really like. These are called armor stands, okay? And I actually think they are incredible. So basically what you can do is I've got a diamond helmet here, click anywhere and it will just go onto it. I think that's a really good, cool way of keeping them when they're red and put the leggings on. I quite like that, I quite like that. And here, here, these are some um, new things. We have Prismine Shard. The Prismine Crystals, which look like that, I quite like them. Here we have Raw Rabbit and Cooked Rabbit, so I'm presuming they're new animals, I'm not sure. Rabbit Stew, similar to Mushroom Stew. Rabbit Foot, not sure why you would need that. Rabbit Hide, and also you can now spawn villagers, which I rather like. And there you go, there's a villager. He's born. He is born. 20 sound paper for an emerald. Not bad at all, so. Oh! I must have spawned it. Come here. Hello. Okay, doesn't like me. Uh, I apologise, guys, if you just heard a noise there. That was my Facebook just being in. Uh, I'm actually going to pause the video for now, guys, and you will see me pausing it, as I realise I've missed one crucial thing out. So I'll be back in just one second, guys.
Again, guys, I am back. Uh, I would like to apologise about that. I just forgot one crucial thing, which are the banners. Oh, yeah. I realise, and there's a pig in between them. I think it's gone to the pink one because it's his favourite colour. Get out of it. Thank you. Let's go back in there. So need to know. Okay, these are the banners, guys, and I realise these are brilliant for decoration. Um, here you see you have the white one, orange, the magenta, the light blue, yellow, lime, pink, grey, light grey. Uh, I believe that's cyan. Yes, it is. It's cyan. Purple, blue, brown, green, or oh, dark green, I should say. Red and black. I don't know why I just said that to you, but I did. Okay, and as you can see, as you look really close, you can actually they sort of move in the wind, which I wasn't too sure about at first because it's not really blocks. But it is. You can walk through them as well, which I think could be quite cool. Maybe feel a secret thing. And over here, we have the bunny rabbits I was on about. I don't want to kill them because it looks so cute. Why do they have red eyes? They look really devilish. Slightly scary. Guys, I have actually noticed one little glitch with the game. Well, certainly in my game anyway. I basically made my friend a world on my uh, laptop. On my PC. So just because, you know, she has gotten into Minecraft. She hasn't really done anything with it. And so I thought, you know, why not? And actually, I tried to place a painting on the wall. Well, no, I basically covered a wall in paintings for her, and it, they'd all just appear. Let's see if it's going to work here. Okay, it's working in this world for some reason. It wasn't in my other world, so I'll have to check that out. Um, yes, it's working fine, but um, basically all the ones that I had before I've now glitched. I'm not sure if that's just my world or what. I will have to check that out, and I will um, tell you in a future video, guys. Also guys, I would like to apologise I haven't actually uploaded a YouTube video for some time. Um, I did actually try to, I went on holiday a long time ago, and I did actually try to upload one before, but it wouldn't let me upload it for some reason. I think it's because I edited it with a movie maker, so, yeah. If you don't know, it's basically not, um, I'm not quite sure what the actual word is, to be honest with you. It's, it's not made for YouTube, let's just say. And so, yeah, so I have to sort of mm, how to describe it. I had to basically convert it to something that is the I message on one. I basically had to convert it to something that is um yeah. That is for YouTube sort of thing. Okay yeah, so I would like to apologize about that but I am back I'm gonna be trying to upload the video as often as I can. But also guys I just want to show you this I've never known there being two black sims in one village before. Probably has been first time I've seen it and right opposite each other and plus I spawned right there. And then also there's another village just over there. Okay, so that is it for now. I would like to say thank you very much for watching. And I will see you in the future. future yeah, sorry, why do I mess up at the very end? I would like to thank you for watching. And I will see you in a future video. 